the four Supergirl Riley, who's acting up. Supergirl Riley is far back and off stride. Here they come. And they're off. Expect an inquiry into the start of the four. The others with a good beginning. From the inside, leaving out is Darling Maris, alongside Custom Cantab. Back into third is Dream Together. Taken off the speed is Top Expectations fourth. Sliding down in fifth goes Hanalore Hanover. Further back to Plunge Blue Chip. And far back is Supergirl Riley. Field is on its way to the quarter. Put up front in the early going is Custom Cantab. Back into second, Darling Maris. Dream Together from in third. Top Expectations fourth. Gap of a length and a half back into fifth there. Hanalore Hanover and trailing from in sixth is Plunge Blue Chip. Further back we go way back to Supergirl Riley. So the field is heading up to three eighths. They're chasing Custom Cantab, leading it by a length and a half. Darling Maris is right there. Second Dream Together continues third. Top expectations from back and forth now. Hanalore Hanover stocking fifth. Plunge Blue Chip is sixth. Field approaches the midway point, and Miller really getting things his own way. 57 seconds down to the half. Custom Cantab leads them into the final turn as Darling Maris tracks intently from the pocket spot. Then Dream Together, top expectations. Hanalore Hanover swings out to go first over and catching cover is Plunge Blue Chip. Three-quarter bound go the trotting mares, angling out from in third. Here's Dream Together. They're on their way to three-quarters chasing custom Cantab. Darling Maris rides pocket. First up out of third is Dream Together. Handle or Hanover moving up into fourth. Slightly gapped on her cover though. Then inside is Top Expectations and Plunge Blue Chip has late work to do. Three-quarters in 126 and one. End of the stretch. Custom Cantab called on for some deep stretch toughness second at the inside there's darling maris looking to angle out from the backfield flying is plunge blue chip darling maris off a pocket ride mapped out by dunn and she'll win an eight to one upset in 153 and two for darling maris Driver Dexter Dunn doubles up in Breeders' Crown Eliminations. This time, Darling Miras takes the first of two open mare trot eliminations uh, for Oka Svonstead, who uh, gets the top two finishes in here. So you have a couple advancing to next week. Uh, given the trip, um, was that best case scenario when you saw the early fractions pop up? Yeah, she's, um, you know, she got herself in a good good position there and following Custom Cantab, which is a, a, a nice one to uh, follow. and. Um, you know, she was really full of trot uh, down the stretch and we got a lucky gap year sort of halfway down and she, she really hit the line great. Yeah, because you had to think when you saw that half that you know the stretch drive is just going to come to probably an all-out sprint and they were all coming there, but um, yeah, I mean, your mare was just so strong. Yeah, she is. She is a really strong going trotter. I drove her there at Meadowlands a, a few months ago now and, and uh, you know, loved her. And um, yeah, like I said, like, Davey really put the speed on with straightening up there and uh, she was tagging on that helmet, you know, she wasn't missing a beat, so... Uh, you know, she's looking in good shape for next week. I know you've only driven her a couple of times. Uh, one of those times she did make a break, and she's known to do that from time to time. Do you have to be careful with her at all? Well, on, on a bigger track today, she felt safe, okay. really safe. So, um, you know, the, the, she was at Tioga the time she made a break and uh, just didn't really handle the, the tighter turn. So uh, she went to Yonkers though and went, went good, so she's, she's going to get around a smaller track, but uh, the big track really does suit her. You know, you and I were just talking off camera last night. It was a little bit cooler than it is tonight. Overall, it's dry. We're happy with that. Track condition, similar to last night? Yeah, it feels a little bit tighter than last night. It was okay. a little bit shiftier uh, last night, I felt, but it's, uh, it's just tightening up tonight better, and uh, you know, the horse is getting around the good. All right, well, another good drive. Nice job. Thank you. All right, Dexter Dunn gets another one into the Breeders' Crown Final. It's Darlene Miraz stamping her ticket to next week's Open Mare Trot.